Anyone here call for a service truck? Because that's what showed up. It is the F-100 service truck from the Model King. It's on deck. Let's get to it. Hey everyone, and welcome to the garage for today's What's in the Box. We're taking a look at the 1965 Ford F-100 service truck kit from the Model King. This is a freshly released kit within the last, I think, three weeks now. It was released. Uh, this is going to be a new kit with an asterisk. The utility bed is going to be new. The truck is going to be uh, u u utilizing previous Moebus uh, 65 Ford uh, truck uh, kit. If you understand how the Model King operates, then you'll understand what that means. If not, the Model King basically uh, does pays for... Uh, to do certain uh, runs of kits. And so the Model King paid for the uh, utility bed tooling and then they used the existing Moebus Ford F100 uh, kit to make this utility truck kit. Uh, like a lot of mo uh, like pretty much all Model King uh, kits, this is probably going to have a very small production run. I don't know I don't know the production numbers, but I don't think it's going to be very large. So if this is a kit that you want to get, I would definitely make sure you jump on it and get it as soon as possible, unless you want to pay higher fee, uh, higher prices for it later on down the road. So with that, let's get to it and let's check it out. And we'll get started with the body. And getting us started with the frame, as you can see the uh, drive shaft is also attached to the frame parts tree. Moving on to the next parts tree in this bag, it has a little bit of everything there. You can see the engine blocks, some, some engine bits, the uh, exhaust, and the tailgate that obviously you will not be using. And one more parts tree from this bag. You see a little bit more engine parts, steering wheel. And moving on to the next parts tree bag. You can see this one has more suspension bit, bits, spare tire wheel, I'm going to guess. And the next parts tree steering column, cross member. And the last one from the sports tree, or leaf springs, and some other bits and bobs. And then moving on to the next part tree bag, and this one as you can see has another tailgate, some more suspension pieces, some wheels, a bumper, a stop bumper, a bunch of other pieces. I'm steering with another steering wheel. Next part street, you can see there's another drive shaft, another uh, frame cross member. Keeping things rolling onto the next parts tree bag. More engine parts. And the next part tree has a couple of uh, transmission options there. One automatic, one's going to be standard. And another parts tree which has a lot more drive shaft options and some other bits and uh, pieces as well. Now on to the next parts tree. This is going to be looking at the interior bits as well as the hood. You can see the uh, interior uh, floor. And then the hood. And now 
You see, uh, left side door panel. And the next part street has the dash, firewall. And now the utility box. First up the bed, little tailgate, front uh, bulkhead, the rear section, and the step bumper there. And now the last of the parts tree for the utility bed, the sides. And the inner, the inside. Now we're going to turn our attention to the chrome parts tree. The first one will be this one that has a little bit of a you know, some valve covers, some hub caps, or some wheel centers, whatever you want to call them, dog dishes. You have uh, some other chrome, some door handles, and some other chrome parts. Porch tree, you have a little bit of everything. You have mirrors, front, uh, front rear bumpers, uh, three sets of mirror options, some wiper blades, some more valve covers, some chrome trim pieces. Next up, the grill. And the next part, chrome part straight out of this baggie. Some more emblems and some more mirrors. And finally, another set of caps. Wheel caps, dog ditches, steely... Now we're going to take a look at the clear parts, I'm just going to move in the baggie, so you can see all the clear parts there. And over here for the utility bed. Some more like that one, the transparent red ones are for the utility bed, these are not. And the backup ones, these are right there, so that set is for the utility. Now moving on to the tires which are going to be your basic standard generic no name no brand no sidewall detail tires. There are five of them in total so you do get one for the spare. Now take a look at the decal sheet. You can see it is pretty full. If you know uh, if you know who Model King is then you know his name. If you know Dave Bur Burkett is his name, the Model King. So you can see he has his own construction company here. And the kit, and then uh, Seven's welding service. Uh, it's uh, Sean Sevendinson. I'm not sure. If, I don't think I'm pronouncing that correctly. He does all the pre-builds, uh, pre-production uh, build-ups for both Model King and Moibus, whatnot. So he has his name here as well. I think that's kind of, kind of cool to be honest. So there is the decal sheet. So that is going to about do it for this look at the 1965 Ford F100 service truck from the Model. King. Right down here it says right there important extra parts. There are a lot of extra parts in there, but a lot of these are gonna a lot of these parts that are in the kit go to some of the other uh, F series kits from both the Model King and um, Moibus. My other recommendation recommendation if this kit is on your list to get, I would not uh, wait to get yourself one. Uh, Model King kits pretty much go pretty quickly, and they're usually a one and a more than like more than usually a one and done type of kit. And once they've been done, the the prices seem to go up for them. So do not hesitate if this is a model kit that you want to get. It would be kind of cool maybe if uh, maybe Moibus or Model King sell the bed separately. I bet to be a really big seller as well. I know I would have just bought the bed myself if. But of course, I'm thinking you can get some Ford color match paint from our buddy Jameson over at Scale Finishes. On that note, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time.